New at 6, the idea of a detox facility in Mobile County is one step closer to becoming a reality. Veterans Recovery Resources is receiving $3.8 million of American Rescue Plan funding. VRR is the nonprofit that would run the facility. NBC 15's Lisa Labrinyak joins us live with more on this. Lisa, Veterans Recovery Resources still needs more money. Yeah, Kim, Veterans Recovery Resources was hoping to get close to $8 million of ARP funding. That didn't happen, but we're told this is a start. It has been so needed for so many years in our community. Virginia Guy is the executive director for the Drug Education Council. She tells me she's thrilled to hear that $3.8 million is going towards a medical detox facility in Mobile. Currently, if somebody needs detox, they are going to have to go out of town. The facility will hold more than 30 beds. Detox is really the crisis stabilization part of addiction treatment. You know, we can't really pr start providing real treatment toward recovery until we get the person medically stable and detoxed. Veterans Recovery Resources still needs approval from the Certificate of Need Board. That would be the next step in the permitting process. In the past, the nonprofit had some pushback from a detox facility in Birmingham, but District 3 Commissioner Randall Dewitt says he doesn't expect that to happen here. I don't really know uh, what their opposition with uh, a veterans recovery center that's going to help local veterans. It's going to help local first responders and their families and their, you know, wives and children. May 20th is the opposition deadline. A public hearing will be held July 20th, followed by a final decision on August 4th. The executive director of Veterans Recovery Resources says the facility is already scheduled to open in April 2023. I'm live in Mobile, Lisa Liberniak, NBC 15 News.